Greetings. Welcome again to D-Lab Electronics. Tonight, I want to show you one of my newest creations, the Cathedra amplifier, based on a Fender Deluxe 5E3 circuit in a cool old cathedral style cabinet. And man, does it sound good. First, I'll show you how it's made, and then you get to hear it. Here she is, the Cathedra, housed in an old GE cathedral style cabinet, zenith speaker cloth, chicken head knobs, cool glass jewel, and the original bezel with D-Lab amps in the background printed on a vintage schematic. Very cool, huh? Controls lineup, input jack, here's your volume, this is treble, bass, and power. And now it's off. So here we are backside. The first thing you're going to spot is a selenium 8 inch speaker. And you may say, hey wait, that's a woofer. Well I guarantee you when you hear this thing, you'll think it's a high power musical instrument speaker. It has the right response. And I used an old Newcomb record player lid to build the baffle board. So I made sure to keep that Newcomb little end there, huh? Now this chassis, this was an old Zenith console radio amplifier. And back in the day, this was a stereo amplifier running a pair of 6BQ5s. Now, it's been converted to a neural amplifier using 6V6 push-pull and the Fender Tweed 5B3 circuit. If you look back at some of my previous videos, you will see this amp in the construction phase. But now it's complete and in the cabinet. So let me point out the components. Obviously, power transformer, filter cap. Here's the 5Y3 rectifier, pair of 6V6s. Here's your output transformer. Here is your inverter tube, and up here is the preamp tube. Speaker output for 8 ohms only, which powers the internal speaker. However, you can unplug that and run this thing as a head. So here we are, bottom side. You can see it turned out really well. I got to reuse all the original terminal boards that were installed in the amp and built in the original Fender Deluxe circuit. However, I did not use the high gain inverter circuit. This is actually the inverter circuit out of a Princeton because I wanted this amp to be more warm and clean than I did brash and distorted. So this is a very full sounding Fenderish amp. Well, you probably noticed that this thing has this ostrich type Tolex on it. The reason I did that was, yeah, it looks cool, but the other issue was is the cabinet was badly damaged. There was missing veneer, so I had to repair that and fill it. And I thought, hey, I got this cool old Tolex. So let's put it on there and see what it looks like. And I think it looks like a million bucks. So now, let's see what it sounds like. Here we are back at D-Lab, and we have a uh, one of Terry's newest amps. <clears throat> this is a push-pull 6V6 type amp. It's kind of taken off of uh, the old Tweed Deluxe circuit. This amp sounds monstrous. It has great, great tone. It is driven a little bit easy, but that's the charm of it, and it's the, just a great tone.
That's about as boutique as boutique gets, don't you think? Old 1930s cabinet, super cool sound, super cool design. That's what D-Lab does. Hope you like it. See you again.